Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm gonna be doing a clothing haul. And if you wanna see everything I got, please keep watching this video. And look at my receipts. Oh my gosh. Someone help me. So recently in Mejia, which is pretty close to where I live, they have, and if you see shadows in the back, that's my brother that keeps peeking through uh, into the video. But anyways, so in Mejia, there's a Bells and it is actually closing. So for their closing, I believe they went bankrupt and all Bells are closing, but I'm not sure on that, but I believe so. I saw it somewhere on Facebook. So since they're closing, they have a big closing sale and this is like a real closing sale because everything at first was like 70% off and now things are bumping up to 80% off, 90% off. And this Bells is a department store and they have a lot of like very good brands. And I went maybe three weeks ago with my sister when they had the 70% off and I got two biker shorts and some leggings and they were pretty cheap. I think they were like $5, but I went yesterday and today with my sister yesterday and with my best friend Victoria today. No, I went with my best friend Victoria yesterday and today I went with my sister and oh my goodness, I got so many things that I decided I just wanted to share it with y'all. And I will be telling you how much I paid for each thing because it's incredible and unbelievable. I'm gonna start with this blouse so i work at a boutique and i typically do dress pretty nice like i kind of have to so i did get a lot of like nicer shirts and just stuff i can wear to work and i love this shirt i was gonna buy one similar to this a week ago and i didn't end up getting it but i'm glad i didn't because i got this one today and it has this little keyhole Kind of back and I love it it's so pretty and look at this sleeve I love a good sleeve so this one was $27.99 I paid seven dollars and 14 cents and this is one of the more expensive but this one was 70% off still but I just really liked it so I did go ahead and buy it so that was one I guess blouse I don't know if this is considered a blouse Next, I got a pink one, or I guess this is like a rosy mauve, and I love this color. My sister actually picked this one out for me, and look at this front part. It's going to be really cute tucked in. It's kind of like what I'm feeling, and look how cute it is. Let me scoot back so you can actually see it. I love it. I've kind of been into this kind of pinkish color here lately. And this one was originally $29.99 and I paid $2.09. Oh my goodness. It's crazy. Okay, next I got this sweater, like knit sweater top. This is so cute. It is a light pastel pink and this is going to be perfect for fall. And this one was $36 and I paid, give me one second, $2.52. Okay, next I got this fluffy soft pullover. I guess that's what these are called, but look at this. This is that like like you want a blanket made out of this kind of fabric and it's super cute i love this hot pink and it has a little tie right here just in case it's too loose you can make it tighter and this is so precious so precious this one was originally 44 dollars, and i paid three dollars and eight cents three dollars and eight cents
Okay, what do we got next? Ooh, this is one of my favorite tops. My sister didn't really love it, but I love this. It's so cute. It's just, and it has this little ruffly part right here that kind of stretches. And then it like opens. This is so cute. This one was $36 originally. And I paid $2.52. Oh my goodness. This is so cute. $2.52. Next, I got a plum color long sleeve with a pocket. I love this. And this one is, this is just like a, like a fall time classic. This was $26 and I paid 55 cents. No way. Yes. 55 cents. This is a wine color. 55 cents 55 cents who even okay next i got this top i when i saw this i loved it i love the fabric because it's very light yet thick i don't i can't really explain it this is kind of supposed to be a little bit cropped but because i'm so short these cropped tops like this to me they fit normally and it has a little bit of embroidery on it, giving me like, I don't know, like Mexican culture type feels. But I love this. This one was $36 and then they marked it down a little bit ago to $17.99. So let me see what it came out to be one dollar and 26 cents for this super cute top i just i can't it's so cute next and this is actually one of the last clothing items i got these so these are maternity uh leggings which doesn't matter because that's just gonna give me more space for my tummy um, these are just a regular large and they're so soft because they're maternity. They got a lot of stretch to them and they're thick. So I love these. These were originally $24.95 and I paid $4.24. That is so good. I even got my brother some shirts, some button ups or button downs. I don't know what they're called. Button ups or button downs? Button downs? I'm not sure, but I got them these. So this was one that I got. This is a light pink, so like a baby pink. And then it has some flowers. Very, very nice. And it is very fresh. It feels kind of like linen. This was originally 29 Wait, no. Yeah, $29.99 and I got it for $7.64. This is probably one of the most more expensive things I got, but it's very nice. It's very nice. Next, oh, I also got my brother another shirt. This is a nice shirt with swans on it you see very very nice button up or down i don't know what they're called this was originally 48 dollars and i paid let me see 48 three dollars and 36 cents three dollars and 36 cents you don't even pay that at a garage sale. That's just wild to me. And he tried them on and they fit perfectly. Sadly, I couldn't find Ulises any shirts because what they had left at the Bells in Mejia was a lot of larger men clothes, like big and tall or just bigger sizes. And I couldn't find Ulises anything. 
These are the only like medium sized shirts that I found for my brother and then I didn't find any for what he says. But that's okay. Next I got this super cute wooden lunchbox. So it's um supposed to be durable and reusable, eco-friendly. It's like a very fancy lunchbox. And it has, it's called All Boxed Up. That's like the brand. It has this little like thick rubber band that goes around it. And then put your lunch in there. And then this is the lid. Isn't this so cute? It's so like modern, so chic. And I love it. I'm gonna use it for my lunch. Not really says lunch because he'll lose this rubber band, but I won't. And this one was originally $15.99 and I paid $4.08. Oh my goodness, I love this. This is like fancy. Okay, and next I got this beautiful 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 purse this is like the purse of my dreams it is so precious it is so cute and i love it this one was originally 58 dollars 58 dollars can you believe that 58 dollars and i paid Two dollars and three cents. Two dollars and three cents for this beautiful, beautiful, precious, beautiful purse. I love it. It's so cute. It's so me. Two dollars. I also got this little purse. This one I got for my niece for her birthday. That's coming up. And this is a little unicorn purse it's super cute look at the zipper i love the zipper because it's rainbow and this one was 28 dollars. i paid three dollars and 92 cents three dollars and 92 cents next i got some beautiful shoes this is what they look like. They are very beautiful. How many times have I said beautiful? These are very, very nice shoes. Um, they didn't have like a big selection of shoes left. And what they did have left, it was mainly bigger sizes. And these were probably the only six and a half that I found, but they're perfect for me. These are so nice. They're perfect for fall time because they're a little bit covered up, but also not. Give you some breathing space in your foot. Those were originally $70 and I paid $4.89. Can you believe that? I bet you can, but it's true. $4, $4. Now we're getting to the good stuff. I got a lot of makeup. So I got a big bag of makeup. And I am so happy because I love makeup and I love good deals because I'm very cheap sometimes. And when you put that together, that's like, the best for me. So I got <clears throat> I got a bronzer from the balm cosmetics. This is in the shade mm, balm desert. I guess take a dip is the shade. Very, very beautiful bronzing shade. This one was originally, let me see, desert bronzer, 
It was originally $21 and I paid $1.47 for this. $1.47. $1.47. Crazy. Ah! I almost broke it. And I also got two Mary Luminizing, Mary Luminizer highlights. These were very, very, very popular. Um, not too long ago on YouTube, uh, everyone was using them and they were supposed to be like a super wow. I haven't used them yet, but this was originally $24. I paid $1.68 for this. And I did get two of them because like how could, because like how could I not? And two Mary Luminizers, oh, let me show you what it looks like. Beautiful, beautiful, high, beautiful highlight. I'm gonna put some right here on my hand, on my arm. I don't know if it's gonna catch. Ooh, that's pretty. Yeah, that's very pretty. Very pretty. I don't know if it's getting it good, but look at my fingers. It's very shiny and not chunky. It's a very fine highlight, like a fine glitter highlight, but it's not glittery. Very nice. Um, I also got two Clinique blushes. One in the shade 03 Berry Pop. This one is a brighter pink shade. Look how beautiful that is. So what... I like to use these blushes that are bright and I just barely dab into them and they look very nice over bronzer. If you look at it just like this, it looks a little intimidating, but you just gotta go light-handed with it if you can. If you're like me, you pack it on. And let me tell you how much I paid for these, but first let me show you the other one. The other one I got is Ginger Pop. And that one looks like this. I love this shade. It's a deeper rose shade and it's very, very pretty. It doesn't seem to have much shine to it. Maybe light, light shimmer, but I don't think they're gonna be shiny at all. I'll have to try out this makeup, maybe in another video. I paid one dollar they were originally 25 dollars and i paid one dollar and 75 cents for each one that's so wild to me i oh that's crazy next i got two essay lauder foundations i've been wanting to try these forever the double wear it's a little pricey though but since it was on sale i was like this is my day they didn't have my shade, but what I did is that I got a darker one and I got and I got a much lighter one and I'm just going to mix them. So I got the shade 1C1 Cool Bone and 4W2 Toasty Toffee. Is it toffee or toffee? Toffee, right? And this one is almost my shade, but it's a little deeper. So my plan is to put in a little bit of the lighter shade and this is going to make my perfect shade. And I'm gonna get to try out the Estee Lauder Double Wear Foundation that everyone raves about. These were originally $43 each one and I paid $3 for each one. So I got a $43 foundation for $3. Love that. I also got two Estee Lauder liquid matte lipsticks. I got a nude and I got a bright pink. Sometimes I like a bright pink lip. 
Oh, I guess this, well, I don't know. So this is what it looks like on the, like the color shade. That's what it looks like on the end. But the actual lipstick doesn't look as bright. I mean, I'm not mad about it, but I guess we'll see like when I put it on. Let me know if you want me to do a video swatching all the things I got, or maybe I should do my whole makeup using my new items. This one was in Quiet Riot. And then the other one, this is a nude, of course. You know, I love nude lipsticks. This was this one is Sweet Nothing. Oh, I love this one. I love nude lipsticks. I, ooh, that smells good. This is just a happy day for me because I got so much makeup. They were originally $28, whoa, $28 and I paid $1.96 for each one, wow, two of them for $4 basically, crazy. And last but not least, I got a lot of Clinique lipsticks. Um, I've used Clinique lipsticks maybe once. But now I have a lot of them. How many did I get? One, three, six. I got nine. I should have got one more to have ten. I got nine Clinique lipsticks. And I'm gonna I can show you like the outside of them. I got this deep red. This is Clinique. This is a Passion Pop. Um, this one is Ruby Pop. This one is more of a bright matte red. And then I got, this one is, let me see. Tender, love this nude color. I bet I'm gonna have a lot of <laughs> nudes. I think I did get a lot. This is Eyelet. So this one is Whimsy, this is a red pink yeah well like a orangey pink color mm, like a mm, i don't know like an auburn yes that's the color and then i got blush how did i not get the same one i'm surprised another nude a pinky nude Subtle. This one is yet another nude. This is a more brown nude. Jesus, I'm gonna have so many nude lipsticks. Icon Pop. This one is another deep matte red. Love this one. And last but not least, Meek. This one, ooh, this is a very, I wonder why I got this. This is a very like spicy red, uh, brown. It looks like cinnamony color. That's nice. And that was the end of my haul. Oh my gosh, I went through everything. That was a lot of stuff. Um, I didn't even pay not even $100. It was like, let's see, 68.48 was one ticket and 17.99 the other ticket. And do you wanna know how much I saved? So on one ticket, I saved $221.88. And on the other ticket, I saved 600 $45.65. I basically saved almost a thousand dollars. That's crazy. So if you have a bells close to you, you need to go. And that was the end of my haul. Let me know if you like these types of videos. I love hauls. And if you do too, then I will love that because you know, I'm always looking for things to buy and spending money when I shouldn't, but I still do it. So if you 
like this video, please subscribe to my channel, like my Facebook page, follow my Instagram. I also have TikTok and Snapchat and we can be friends. And thank you so much for supporting my channel and for watching this video. I will see you guys again next time. Oh, I do have something very, very, very exciting coming. So be on the lookout for my next video that I will upload on Friday. Bye. That was it.